Hey guys, this video is going to show you what the benefits of training your stats are. I'm just going to say now that stats don't affect SP and they don't affect weapon specials unless of course the weapon special happens 100% of the time. Now strength, dexterity and intellect are primary stats and before you train any other stat you should train one of these three first. And endurance, charisma and luck are what we call substats and they help you customise your build. As you watch the video I'm going to explain the benefits of each stat and the text in red is what the stat has a big effect on and the text in blue is what this stat has a smaller effect on. So for strength, as you increase it, it will improve your melee damage and your melee accuracy and also your range damage and without training strength you won't be able to use melee weapons because they'll be really crap basically. Now as you train your dexterity you'll improve your accuracy for all player attacks and you increase your range damage by a bit. It's also the main stat that increases your blocking chance. Now as you increase your intellect, you increase your MP and the amount you heal from an MP potion. It also increases your magic and spell damage and your magic and spell accuracy. And without training intellect, you won't be able to use magic weapons and you won't be able to use magic spells. Now as you increase your endurance, you increase your HP and the amount you heal from a HP potion. And you'll notice you'll heal more from a healing spell. Now as you increase your charisma, you improve your pet and guest damage and their accuracy. And it also improves how useful they are. So if you have a pet or guest with a healing ability, then the higher your charisma, then the higher your heal from that healing ability. Now look, slightly improves your accuracy for all player attacks. And it also slightly improves the amount you heal from a HP and MP potion. And it also grants you a 10% chance to do a lucky strike. And no matter how high or how low your luck is, the chance for a lucky strike to happen is 10%. As your luck gets higher, your lucky strikes will do more damage. A lucky strike is basically a critical strike, as you might have saw in other games. Right, so I'm just going to show you the stats page on my website. And here you can see the benefits of training your stats, which is this video I'm recording right now. And you can see how to train and untrain your stats. As you scroll down a bit further you can see my two tables and what you want to do is you enter your stats in these. Just gonna... The build I've got is a high endurance beast warrior and it's pretty cool. I like it anyway. And it will show you if you have any stat points untrained. And you can see the benefits that your stat points are going to give you. And here you see I've got high HP. I work great when using melee weapons and ranged weapons. And my pets are pretty cool and strong and I've got a high blocking chance. Now on the table on the right, say if you wanted to change your build to something I recommended in my build advice video, you type in your current stats again. Say if you wanted to change to a an ILA to Beast Mage, you type in the stat points that I recommended to have in my build advice video and it'll look something like this. and you can see here how much gold it's going to cost you to change your stats and you have the option when you change your stats to pay with Z tokens instead of gold but I wouldn't recommend you do this because as you can see it's going to cost you loads to change them so sticks are paying with gold and this page is going to give you all the information you need to know about stat points and of course as you scroll your cursor over the character advice section you can see my advice and other things that's it, thanks for watching guys, I'll see you in another video.